algebraic terms, simplifying by adding and subtracting. When we are adding and subtracting in algebra, we can only add and subtract what's called like terms. Now, like terms contain exactly the same pronumerals, and the pronumeral parts have the same powers. So, x and 2x are like terms, because they've got exactly the same pronumerals in them. 6xy and 3yx are still like terms because they've got the same pronumeral parts. They don't need to be in order. 2y squared and y squared like terms because they've got the same pronumeral parts and the pronumerals have the same powers. So like terms, same pronumeral parts, and the same powers of those pronumerals. So if we had a little set here of not like terms, then x and x squared not like terms. Same pronumeral, but different power. xy squared and yx squared. Not like terms. Same pronumerals, but the y is squared here and the x is squared here. So there's some traps to not fall into. Now the reason we're looking for like terms when we're adding and subtracting is that we're just counting identical things when we add and subtract and we're simplifying to do that. So if I'm asked to simplify by combining like terms this reads as 7 lots of t plus 2 lots of t minus 3 lots of t. So really I'm just working out how many lots of t I have whatever t is. And so to add or subtract by combining like terms, we identify the like terms. T and T and T, they've all got the same pronumeral part. So 7T plus 2T minus 3T, they're all like terms. And I just add or subtract the coefficient of the like terms. So really, 7 lots of t plus 2 lots of t, that would be 9 lots of t, minus 3 lots of t gives me 6 lots of t, 6t. When you're adding and subtracting, one of the best things you can do, if you're a little bit confused, is make that an animal. t is now a tortoise. 7 tortoises plus 2 tortoises minus 3 tortoises, 6 tortoises. That's all we're doing. We're counting lots of t. Now this next example, 4x plus 3y plus 2x plus 7y, this has two different things that we're counting. It could be xylophones and yaks, I don't know. But it's 4 lots of x plus 2 lots of x. So I can only add those two together because they're the one. It's lots of x. If this was xylophones, I've got six xylophones. If this is yaks, I've got ten yaks. All we're doing is counting x's and counting y's. It is a good idea to identify your like terms. 4x plus 2x, those are like terms. Plus 3y and plus 7y, those are like terms. If you want, now this is an optional line here, so I'll put it in green, you can rearrange to say, well, I've got 4x plus 2x, you keep the sign with the thing that comes after it, plus 3y plus 7y. If you want, that's an optional line, you can do that, 
because then it's very easy to get 4x plus 6, 2x is 6x plus 3y plus 7y is 10y. But that green line there is optional. We're just adding or subtracting the like terms. Now this one, getting more complicated to find our like terms because I've got xy and yx and x and x squared. So you look for the pairs of like terms. 4xy does go with 5yx. Same pronumerals, order doesn't matter. Don't forget to keep the minus with the x. And that goes with plus 2x. And plus 3x squared is on its own. It doesn't have any like terms. So we're really just asking, how many lots of xy do I have? I've got 4 plus 5 lots. This will be 9 lots of xy. How many lots of x do I have? Minus 1 lot plus 2. So I've got 2x minus 1x, because remember this has an invisible 1. So this would just be 1x, so I can write plus x. And then plus 3x squared, because I've just got 3 lots of x squared. And you remember that x and x squared are different. They're not the same thing. So be very careful when you're simplifying by combining like terms. This works for adding and subtracting. You keep the sign, plus or minus, with the term that comes after it. And you're counting how many lots you've got of identical things. And the rule that we need to follow is step one, identify like terms. Step two is add or subtract Oops. the coefficients, the numbers in front, of like terms only. And remember, no changing the pronumeral part. No seeing, oh look, I think I've got x and 2x, it's going to be x squared. Uh, uh, uh. You're just counting x's. Don't change the pronumeral part. Sorry about the bell there. <laughs>